according to Ukraine Defense Cemetery, nearly one, 150 tanks have been destroyed and some uh, 4,300 4, Russian troops have been killed in the fighting as of February 27. Experts said all the statistics should be treated with much caution because of the fog of the war and insensitive both Russia and Ukraine have to push particular narrative. Ukrainian officials have also accused Russia of war, of war crimes after reports of sharing an orphanage in the kindergarten outside of Kiev. Across Ukraine, thousands of, of civilians and all of age are enlisting to fight. Ukrainian, Ukrainian called on the resident to make Molotov cocktails to defend against the invasion. About 18, 18,000 weapons have been distributed in the Kiev region. According to the Ukrainian officials, meaning why about, about 500,000 Ukrainians have fled the neighborhood country like Poland since the conflict began. According to the United Nations estimate, huge crowds have rushed to board the trains from Kiev to cities in the west, such as Lviv. Why some of these staying ports have sought shelter in subway station. Ukrainian officials have also accused Russia of all crimes after report of sharing enough knowledge of kindergarten outside Kiev. Last year, Russia presented the U.S. with the list of demands, some of which were known status for the United Nations for the United States and its areas in the North Atlantic Treaty Organization. Putin demanded the NATO to stop its eastward expansion and deny membership to Ukraine and also made other demands for security guarantees around NATO. The prospect of Ukraine and Georgia joining NATO has antagonized Putin as the least since President George W. Bush expressed support for the idea in 2008. He said that that was no mistake. That was said by Pifa, who from, uh, who from uh, 1998 to 2000 was ambassador to Ukraine under President Bill Clinton. That uh, he told the Vox, pop, the, the Vox in January. It dropped the Russian nuts. It created the expectation in Ukraine and Georgia, which then were never met. And so that just made that whole issue of enlargement a complicated one. Ukraine is the fourth largest recipient of military funding from the U.S. and the intelligence cooperation between the two countries has deepened in the response to threats from Russia. But Ukraine is just joining NATO for the near future. And President Joe Biden has said, as much still, Moscow's demand was largely seen as no starter by the West, as NATO open door policy says sovereign countries can choose their own security areas. Though, Putin has continued to thwart the threat of NATO. His speech on February 21 showed that his obsession with Ukraine goes far beyond that he does not see the government of Ukraine as legitimate. Ukraine is not just a neighboring country for us. That's a Putin. It is an inerable part of our own history, cultural and spiritual space. He said by the Kremlin official translation. Since Tamri and Momerio, the people living in the south west of what he has historically been Russian land have called themselves Russians. The two countries do have the historical and the cultural ties, but the news from the Vox said explained that Putin basically claim that there is no historical Ukraine national worthy of present day sovereignty. It's demonstrable, it's demonstrable false, as experts noted. It is difficult to square Putin's speech, plus a, a 200, a, a plus a 2,031 essay he penned at other statements he's made 
with any sort of realistic diplomatic outcome to avoid conflict. It was essential a confession that this wasn't really about NATO. That was said by Dan Baer, the acting director of the Europe program at the Carnegie Endowment for International Peace and the former ambassador of the Organization for the Security and the Cooperation in Europe. But, however, this is the culmination of the eight years of tension. This is, isn't the first time Russia has attacked the Ukraine. In 2014, Russia annexed the Crimean Peninsula, invaded eastern Ukraine, and backed Russian separatists in the eastern Donbass region. That, conf that conflict has killed more than 14,000 people to date. Russia also to grow out of mass protesters in Ukraine that toppled the country's pro-Russian president Viktor Yanukovych Yanuko, Yanuko, while he began over his abandonment of trade agreement with the European Union. U.S. diplomats visited the demonstrations in symbolic gestures that further agitated Putin. President Barack Obama hesitated to escalate tension with Russia and with further was slow to mobilize a diplomatic response in Europe and did not immediately provide Ukrainians with, of, with offensive weapons. Since then, corruption has persisted in the Ukrainian government and the country lacked the bottom third of the watchdog group, Transparency National Index. Ukraine's far right presence has grown and become somewhat normalized and there were government around fascist militias in the country. But Moscow has drawn out of those issues to advance false claims about the genocide and other attacks on civilians as a way to legitimize the separatist movement in eastern Ukraine and to create a pretext for invasion. In his pre-recorded speech, shared on the eve of the bombardment of Ukraine, Putin said he thought the denazification of Ukraine. To be clear, the, Ukra the Ukrainian government is not a Nazi regime and has not been co-opted by the far right. Zelensky is Jewish. He speaks proudly of how his Jewish grandfather fought against Hitler's army. Yet, this area, Putin used this sort of crimes as a part of his explanation for recognizing as independent the so-called Luhansk People Republic and the Donetsk People Republic, the two territories in the eastern Ukraine where he has backed separatists since 2014, announcing the decision taken today. I'm confident that the support of the citizen Russia of all those patriotic forces of the country, Putin said that before moving troops into the region for the peace, peacekeeping purposes. At the time, more experts that uh, spoke to the Vox, the source of our news, spoke that uh, uh, said that they looked like beginning, not the end of Russia inclusion into Ukraine. In Russia. It provides a political legal basis for the formal introduction of Russian forces, which they all already decided to do. That was said by Kaufman of the CNA. Secondary, it provides a legal local basis for Russia to use force in defense of this independent republic. Russian citizen there. It's basically political theater. It set the stage for the next step, he added. Those steps are now clear. Thank you for watching. I hope the updates. Please stay tuned for the next content and update on the Russo Ukraine war.